Hey everyone, Dave here. Welcome to Hitman 3 Reloaded Overview. I love how this release is essentially hidden in the quest store, even though it's one of the biggest one we've had in history on the platform. Like the recent changes with Apple App merging turned it completely into a clown show. When I first saw this announcement, I was very confused because I know for a fact that IUI, which is the original developer of the Hitman series, doesn't give two shits about the VR technology, hence why their version of the port is just a hot mess and was essentially left in the dust. This one, however, exclusive for Quest 3, was made completely by some other people, so there is some hope that it's gonna turn out good, but who knows, like this series is kinda cursed by now. So Hitman 3 Reloaded is a stealth action game where, as the world's top assassin Agent 47, you'll take on the most important contracts of his entire career to track, follow and exterminate your targets. We all know what this game is about, my personal experience is very little, however, across the internet, it's a cult classic and it's very hard to not know who Agent 47 is. It's interesting that XR Games went with the third version of the series, so it's the newest one from the recent trilogy and I think it's still being developed with DLCs and stuff. Why I'm mentioning the failed port of IOI? Well, they really fucked up, because if they would properly do their little port, then maybe we wouldn't even have the reloaded version. Talking about the god-awful control system and interactions that just don't make sense. Now, seeing the reloaded situation, this is a cell shaded project that still comes across as the original, but I think the vibe overall is gonna be way different. Honestly, my only wish is that the game will be playable and then it's gonna be fine, because the content alone is enough to keep people entertained for months. I suppose also if the actual full experience is being ported instead of couple missions. From looking at the trailer, maybe the exclusive part doesn't really come across because the art style and graphical fidelity isn't like crazy, but then again the ambient AI and what's happening in the world around you might take up a lot of processing power. And then we have NPCs who have their own behavioral patterns, like it's a very packed title and if this is gonna be a success, might as well be a system seller here. Anyhow, everything will be unveiled during the gameplay, like there's been a lot of speculations and kinda a surprise release situation, but I feel like it can get any worse than the previous one. Let's become the Agent 47. Oh my god, are we still having this flat screen menu bullshit? Like. Did anything change or is it a straight port of a port? I mean, I'll go through the settings, but... I don't see it already. <laughs> and the videos. I mean, Resident Evil 4 had that, so whatever. Well, actually, do I need it? Because I tried it before. Uh, well, <laughs> it's us. Complicated as before, actually. <laughs> There are actually some different stuff. Please, no. Why I'm so confused? Because the instructions are from the original and then 
What is going on? Jesus. So this is the cell shading. It ain't the worst. But they are kind of flying over the ground. And I feel like the hit registers before I actually do that. Like it feels off to me. I mean, it's not as bad, but still not enough for our standards. And what is going on there? <laughs> it's not even how you hold the katana. Oh, this is gonna be rough. The resolution isn't crazy either. Jesus, the pixels. It's like stuff is flickering. Again, this point and click stuff. It's a mess. Oh, yes. Now we're talking. We're also in the ragdoll world. Maybe the weaponry is fine. It's like we're going back to basics. I just don't like how it moves my arm. The automatic would be fine if it not do just go on the side. Pixel bullets, that's something new. A 
I also don't understand the purpose of that, like... I don't know how I did it. <laughs> Wait, this is the ship. I don't like the solutions here. But in this window, everything's so smooth, like... What am I even shooting? I'll tweak some stuff and then go into the actual mission. Are you sure about this? I am. There are no second chances, Miss Burnwood. Not here. I choose him. May I inquire why? A blank slate, antisocial, apathetic and unresponsive. No doubt the boy shows promise, but... Perhaps I see possibility where others see limitation. Isn't that what a handler does, sir? We'll see. Anyone can kill Miss Burnwood. He still remembers nothing? If he does, he's not sharing. We will check up on his story. The hospital in Romania. In the meantime, keep him under close watch. It feels kind of like cheating because it's exactly the same game as I've tried before. However, that was a couple years ago, so I don't know what to think about this. Wait, what's the <laughs> next path or something? Welcome to Advanced Mission Training. This operation originally took place in Sydney. The target was Calvin Ritter, infamous cat burglar, also known as the Sparrow. You will need to infiltrate the yacht, isolate and eliminate your target and exfiltrate, all without arousing suspicion. And remember, as an ICA agent, you are the most dangerous person in any room. But blunt force will get you nowhere in this business. And a true assassin never calls attention to himself. Good luck, Initiate. As previous tests have established, you exhibit an unusual level of enhanced sensory perception. Use your instinct now to sense the position and movement of people around you and identify your target. My position, I don't know where I am because I can't see through this. Resolution BS. The edges are just pretty much moving at this point. <laughs> then people disappearing even in close distance. It's not it. Like it hurts to see. Hey, you, I can't let you through looking As like suspected, that. security won't hey, allow you on board in your current down. outfit. <laughs> we should avoid confrontation and look for another way in. Are you sure? You heard it. <laughs> <laughs> and this piece of shit. Yeah. Uh. Hey, help! I need help. Holy shit, gunshot. Get in the gear. Give me the gun. Well, that went well. I remember there was another way through the kitchen, I think. Yeah, we're essentially doing the same content. However, now it's playable, so... It 
it's not the worst. That mechanic is in your way. Sneak up and subdue him quietly. But that essentially means that they replaced the group buttons with A. Nothing else. Okay, maybe some stuff. There's a lot of floating e UI. This particular uniform should get you access through the staff entrance. Just act normal. Day. It doesn't look like a quest for exclusive at all. Oh, there's a smart map. Where you will go, mate? Don't resist. Right. They won't find him anytime soon. I mean, it is. Resident Evil 4 ish, but with a worse execution in general, graphically. Like, I can't look at it. Giving serious Grid Legends vibes. Hold on. That mechanic with his back turned? He's what we call an enforcer. Hello, he man. knows his crew and he'll see right through your disguise. So stay out of his line of sight. You're in. Well done, Initiate. Right, now for the tricky part. Start by locating your target. Intel suggests he's around the bar area. so much love and care. It's okay. If this is what Mr. Ritter's yacht looks like, I wouldn't mind seeing that house of his in Switzerland. Oh, not one bit. I wish Bernie cared about art, but no, Bernie likes musicals. Hmm. Have you tried this texting thing? It's really quite addictive. I'm gonna look around and it's yours. Everyone provided for? Good. I'll be upstairs. I must Mr. say, it's really impressive. It means a lot coming from you, Terrell. It is nice to be among NPCs and knowing that you're being observed, you can interact with them and stuff like that, though she has pixelated eyes even, like... The content is there. Hmm, to be expected. British private deck is off limits for mechanics. If Assimilation is the name of your game, you'll need a better disguise. I mean, I know what to do. I know why I'm playing around. Uh, hello. I'm... I'm Terry Norfolk. I'm here to see Calvin. Hmm. Uh, Mr. Norfolk, welcome. Mr. Ritter's inspecting. What do I think? That's true. What was the proper aiming, though? Because <laughs> I just don't want to point and click. Okay. <laughs> That's gonna leave a mark. Good thing we have insurance. Oh. Okay. Unlike mechanics. The cabin crew is allowed upstairs access. I see what you're getting at. Very unorthodox. I like it. And to go! So I'll just... Execute the mission firstly. The target's private deck. Now we're getting somewhere. Ah, but... 
According to Intel, Ritter is another enforcer who picks his own cabin crew. So tread carefully. Blending in, I see. Well done, Initiate. The Sparrow cannot die. You're not a superhero, Calvin. They don't exist. Well, not with that attitude, they don't. Jesus, the favorite rendering. Mate, go inside. I don't have time. <laughs> Hello, sailor. You have been compromised. Quickly, try and lose them and change your. Disguise. Nice and slow. I got you in my sight. I'm glad we came to an understanding. I'm gonna come closer. Nothing to worry about. Double tap. Keep firing! I'm over it anyways. Well, I did say that if the game would be playable, then it's gonna be fine. However, in the state that it is now, it is like borderline embarrassing that this level of graphics was accepted to the shoe store. It is a big brand, but we need to have some standards and in that category, this ain't it. In terms of the controls and all the Hitman mechanics, things were a bit upgraded, still not to the point that it is a full-on VR game. At this point I don't know what to expect from this series and if there will be some graphical update, we might as well continue. I just don't know why it was released in a state like that. Is it really what Quest 3 is capable of? Because I don't think so, honestly. It might be just coming down to the developer skills and getting a big brand, but dogging it at the same time. I don't think it should be acceptable. We shall see, like, that's not what I expected.